Hi! <laughs> You're not my Uncle Roger. Sure I am. The fresh air and good food keep me looking young. Right. I guess the fresh air also made you taller, changed your hair color, shaved your mustache. Okay, you win. You must be Emma. I'm Brandon. Roger's in the house, I think. Cheryl's in the stables giving the horses medicine. The horses are sick? Yeah. It's been rough riding these last few months. Stud fees are down, too. We're not winning much these days. Hi, Emma. You look fantastic. And I hear your riding's getting better and better. Ready to win some races? Hey, Caitlin. Definitely. The way I'm feeling, I could outrun the horses. Good. To tell the truth, we need all the help we can get. Hey! Stop chatting and get to work, you two! Is that any way to welcome a guest? Gotta go, Emma. Work to do. See you around. Emma? Oh, there's my little filly. What's going on? Brandon, mix the fee. Caitlin, check loose to Pooster's hooves and walk triple Z. Oh, it's Cheryl. She always sounds like she has burrs under her saddle. See you around, Emma. So, this must be the niece. That's right. The best rider in Pennsylvania. Now she's ready for the big time in Kentucky. Roger, please. One rider won't make a difference. You should have sold when you had the chance. Well, she's she's not always like that. Oh, yes, she is. She goes from a mare to a nag. Well, it's been a tough year. Don't worry, Uncle Roger. We'll do well enough this season to buy ten more ranches. Oops, I left my luggage at the gate. Well, if she has a stride to match her spirit, Things are going to get interesting. Brandon, my boy, things are going to get very interesting.